What is up, gamers? Um, kind of felt kind of aggressive, actually. So we finished the game, pretty bot fire, at least the what I think space game. And now we are starting core. About a year later. Okay, yeah, I think that, I think that the stuff was added later. The last two chapters. And man, core is spooky. You need four crystal hearts to continue this level. Ta-da, I have all of them. And another, oh, I forgot, I have two dashes again. Another caveat is, as you saw, you cannot recover dashes by standing. So, you're kind of, you have to either switch screens or uh, collect an energy thing. So that's fun. That doesn't really do me any good. There we go. But yeah, I've never... Oh God damn, I've never been too fond of this level. Not too sure why. I, I think it would be hard to, for me to really grasp the reason. Um, I think it... If I had to take a guess, it could be that I just had like a bad first experience. And that just kind of like stuck with me. Because... Oh, actually, don't I know how to do that now? Hold on. Oh, I could double dash, but I want to try something that I learned. Oh my, that is so good. So I learned how to climb a wall by jumping, and it doesn't consume any, any, any energy, which means that you can pretty much just, like, infinite wall climb, and that's pretty strong. And so how you're supposed to do it is you... You jump off the wall, and then the moment you jump, you push in. Because um, if you normally are pushing in off of a wall because you want to like be in, it pushes you like way too far out. You can't. You can't do anything. If you just jump like that, it's enough that you can just push back in, and then you can just climb forever. Like this is me holding left, or like holding towards the wall. This is what it. Oh my god. Uh, this is what it looks like. Like it's super far, and this is me just tapping it. Like that's like half the distance, and you can easily cover it back. I don't know how far I am in right now, but I'm making progress. That's for sure. And then do that. Oh, <laughs> I actually grabbed that part there. That's crazy. Damn. Yeah, this is. gonna be a little tricky here. There we go. Yeah, I, th I think trying to deal with the, like, all the moving parts can definitely be really tricky. And you can just... Oh, crap. I need my dash. You just kind of get a feel for it, or you need to get a feel for it. Uh, random stuff. So I was playing Monster Hunter earlier. Rise, of course. It's the most recent one. And, um... I don't know if I have any Monster Hunter enjoyers out there, but I've been I've been kind of like wanting to play it recently, but I have been having a hard time getting like the motivation to play if that makes sense. And so I thought, okay, why don't I go back to my uh, my main weapon, which I know, cry me a river. I am a long sword main. Oh my god, I was so close. Um, I've actually kind of become a huge fan of Greatsword, but, you know, I thought, I thought it'd be a good way to get me wanting to play, and I've been using Sacred Sheath, and like, man, Sacred Sheath feels so good to use. I'm not a, I'm still not a huge fan of the, um, uh, what's it called? The mechanic of like holding it and burning meter, I feel like it's kind of mid. But I think Sacred Sheath is really good for like keeping your momentum in the fight. Cause that is like so many extra iframes. And I feel like that's kind of what Longsword is built for, is just spitting out iframes like no tomorrow. At least that's how I prefer to play the weapon, because um that's just kinda how I always 
he used it in World. Oh, I mean, I guess that's kind of how you're supposed to use it, honestly. Because World was my first monster in a game, and I still cannot believe that I used the longsword pretty much the whole game, purely because of the meme that I was like, I, I decided to make a character. I decided to make. Yasuo and Monster Hunter, yes, League of Legends, Yasuo and Monster Hunter, and, uh, why, why did I do that? Dude, how much more is there? I remember, you actually turned this to ice. Um, yep, there we go. Dude, I am, like, really stretching my luck right now. Holy moly, okay. Oh, this one's annoying. Because you have to jump, 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 and then dash, and then jump again. <sighs> my, my problem with these is I'm, I'm like really bad, bad with the block timings. Oh, wait, that's just a strawberry. God damn it. Oh, hey, and I, are we done? Maybe? Hopefully. Nope. <laughs> oh, we're doing this this gimmick now. I will say the seaside though, for this level, was probably like the, the most fun I had in a seaside my whole time playing this game. Cause the seasides in this game are tough. But this this level seaside was actually pretty baller. I had to like do a small hop there, but I didn't have time Oh, wow, that was close. I have a feeling I'm probably supposed to conserve my dashes, so I should probably do that and just go with the tempo. I've already used one dash, so that's bad. Oh, never mind. I'm fine. And there we go. That was core. What's funny is this is actually my current wallpaper, and for a second I was wondering why the game was streaming my wallpaper. Or, not why why my wallpaper was being recorded. I was, <laughs> I was like, why is my desktop being captured? But, yeah. I really like this. I think it's a nice... It's not too... Um, what's it called? The picture's not too, like, full of stuff. And it's pretty just chill, you know? Um, oh, that's actually really cool. Hold on, let me look at that again. I like how the, the mountain just like caves carves out. But this is where we're gonna be next, which is farewell. But that's for another time. And that's probably gonna be a long longer video because this is the longest chapter in the game. Oh I just hope I can finish it in ample time, because it's um Well, I can explain more about the chapter when I play it, like my experiences, but yeah, for now, that's it. Thank you very much for watching. We have one more chapter. And um, yeah, I will catch you in the next one. Peace out.